Oh, you gotta get some gourds. It's the fall. You gotta get a gourd. You gotta get gourds. Gotta get a gourd. You gotta get a gourd. Get some gourds. Please listen to me. You need to get gourds. If you're gonna be participating in the fall, you need to get your hands on some gourds. You want people to walk by your front porch and you want them to go, How many gourds is that? Six, and there's more where that came from. I mean, look at me. I've got the dream team right here. You can't just get one gourd. You need a whole bunch. It's got to be a coalition. The problem with gourds is that you got to make sure, I mean, you got to remember where you're going to put them around the house. Otherwise, you're going to get spooked. I mean, if I took a corner and saw, Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, what is that? What is that, Drew Carey? Get that out of here! Okay, don't get me wrong. If I were to see these little freaks in April, I would give them a titty twister and call a priest. But when I get my fall goggles on, I gotta have them! I gotta if I look at this, in, I don't know, June, I would scream the names of the three little pigs and drop trowel. I'd put myself on iTunes. But I mean, right now, it's the fall. You gotta get some gourd. Basically what a gourd is, it's when two pumpkins fall in love and dry hump at the mall, and then they have a pumpkin baby, and then they give that baby to Drew Carey, who breastfeeds it pizza. You can just, you can just stack, hook yourself up with this little do-gooder right here. This is a straight-A student. You gave a bowl of oatmeal some pamphlets about Alexander Technique, this is what you would get. This is a little problematic right here, because this guy's just kind of lingering in the back, looking like he's trying to muster up the courage to ask for more Twitter followers. I don't really like this, this one's attitude, to be perfectly honest with you. This guy's seen it all. He's already, like, bored with it. He's like the... He's like, he's got senioritis, even though he's only a sophomore. Oh, good for you! Yeah, all my friends were seniors, so I don't really know what I'm gonna do this year. I'm sick of these things. Son of a bitch. This month I spent about 25k on gourds a lot. I know that it's fall. I've got gourds. It's a slippery slope. I mean, I honestly have a hard time stopping buying gourds. Uh, I just keep going to the store. You know, sometimes I honestly slip a couple of my pockets. This looks like a teenager who got introduced to Radiohead too soon. Oh, your parents introduced you to Radiohead? That's so awesome. Parents who introduce your kids to good music at a young age, shame on you. Until my daughter was eight, she exclusively listened to Who Let the Dogs Out? And sure, she may not have the best balance, and she may not be able to do simple math equations, but at least she's not some Ichabod Crane child who's afraid of his own dick. Look at these bumpy little freaks. You gotta get these bumpy little freaks in your house. If I walk by your house and I don't see between 15 and 20 gourds on your front yard, I'm gonna piss in your front yard and I'm not gonna wipe.